Close your eyes. Watch your breath. All the way in, all the way out. Be determined that you're going to stay here. If you're not really determined, the other voices of the mind start to eat away, and you find yourself someplace else. So you've got to stick with your determination. Today's the beginning of the rains retreat. The monks are going to determine that they're going to stay here for three months. And it's usually a custom to take on some extra, extra practices, meditating more, exercising more restraint, noticing where their weak points are in the practice and trying to strengthen those, strengthen those points so the practice is good all around. And lay people often take the opportunity to use this time, the three months, to accelerate their practice too. Because otherwise it tends to drift off. We have to keep reaffirming our determination, reaffirming our intention to make sure that we stick with it. Because after all, we like the results of good things, good actions that are consistent. We don't like our happiness to go up and down. Yet when we create causes that go up and down, especially when they get weaker, then the results aren't going to be what we want. So we try to make our conditions stronger and stronger. The body wastes away as, with time, but the mind doesn't have to waste away. So look what you can do during this next three-month period to figure out to accelerate your practice, to make it more complete. And then learn how to stick with it. There's a quality of patience that's required. You have to have endurance, because there are going to be fallow periods. And you need the strength and conviction to carry you through. So a lot of good qualities get developed as you focus on something that's a little bit special, maybe a little bit challenging, to make what a John Foon would call a monument to the goodness in your life. We see stone monuments all around us, and sometimes they're the things that are honorable, and sometimes they're things that are kind of strange. But you want to make a monument in your heart, in other words, something you can remember, that you did something specially good at one point, and here's an opportunity to do something just like that. Three months where you're more restrained, three months where you practice more. Whatever you feel you need to do in order to improve the quality of your mind, well, here's a chance to do it. What other people will be doing it. And the reason we have this custom is that when other people are doing it, that gives you some encouragement. In the same way, when the monks live together for in a settled way for three months, ideally they're giving one another encouragement so that everybody's practice gets stronger.